Hi guys, it's Jenny for Women's Football uh, TV. I've just, well, I, re I watched the, the Champions League game of Barcelona women versus Manchester City women um, in the Champions League. The lineup was not really, there wasn't much difference to what played last week. Uh, in goal, it was Ali Roebuck. Then there was Bronze, Dahl Kemper, Greenwood and Morgan, Walsh, Muris, Weir, Kelly Hemp and Captain uh, Ellen White. There was uh, 10 subs on the bench, so they were quite well uh, sorted for subs, should they need to bring any on. Um, so the, the game started and Barcelona took the... Um, they took the game to Manchester City very, very early on and I think City allowed them to, really. Um, they were maybe a little bit too respectful. Um, it was all Barcelona. City was struggling to get even a foot on the ball. The, the Barcelona midfield were just running rings, really, round the, round our, uh, round the City um, midfield. Roebuck made a, a great save on 14 minutes to keep them out. Um, and then three minutes later, there was another Barcelona shot, which again was, uh, it went wide. Um, then there was a foul by Hemp, which gave them another free kick in the Manchester City third. Um, but luckily for us, the uh, free kick flew over Roebuck's goal. Uh, Weir was booked on 14 minutes and um, she had a shot saved on 22 minutes. City then did get a chance after 24 minutes of the game, which is really unlike City. They usually, you know, attacking straight from the off. Um, so Barcelona were actually getting a little bit of testing in their defence. Um, another great save from an Alexa shot um, by Roebuck. Corner. The volley was not on target, luckily. Uh City were just causing trouble for themselves at the back. Um, they insist on this playing out from the back. And uh, really all they needed to do was just boot it out at times rather than try and play it out. But they, they tried to play it out and then they get get into trouble and Barcelona would just jump on the chances. Um, Ellie Roebuck had several saves in the first half. It could have been easily four, maybe five nil. Um, just to Barcelona in the first half. White then did have a shot on 32 minutes, um, but it was off target. Uh, and then shortly after that, Barcelona go up to the Manchester City end and score. It was a Ashola that has scored the goal for Barcelona to make it 1-0. Um, Lucy Bronze had a cross which was caught by the Barcelona keeper. White was through, but then she was deemed offside. Um, another save from Ellie Roebuck. City just needed to stop the mistakes, really, in their own half. Uh, and a lot of that was down to the, this played out from the back, which doesn't always work. Then there was a foul on Hemp for 40, on 41 minutes. Um, from that free kick, Muris does get the ball in the net, but it was ruled offside. Another good cross from Chloe Kelly, which is caught by the keeper. So it finishes at half time with uh, Barcelona 1 0 up when it could have so easily been four, five, maybe even six goals up. Um, although City did have some chances and they had, like I say, had the ball in the net, but it was offside. Second half, um, Stokes came on right at the start for Esme Morgan. Um, and she gives away a penalty seven minutes in, um, which obviously Barcelona then go ahead and score. Um, just a few minutes later, um, when City are really needing to get back into it, um, they give away a penalty to Manchester City. Um, Chloe Kelly stepped up to take it. Unfortunately, it was more or less central to the goal and it was a good height for the keeper and she saved it um so it it was still 2-0 um hansen came off for barcelona and their um goalkeeper their player of the year came on uh, in inca martins on 61 minutes um 
City then got a free kick and rather than playing it forward, they go back and what do they do? But they play themselves into trouble. Um, then on 70 minutes, there was a double change by both teams. Uh, Barcelona made their double change and at the same time, Kelly and White came off for uh, Rose Lavelle and Georgia Stanway. I think just to see if we could change anything really and get this get the game back. Um, maybe if we'd have just scored one goal, it it would have put a totally different slant on it. Uh, Hemp had a a great chance on seventy seven minutes, but it was just out of Stanway's reach. Um, and a lot of the time, City were getting forward and they were ruled offside. Um. And then right at the end, five minutes before the the full time whistle, um, Barcelona just pop up and, and get another one. So it ended three nil. Um, what do I think about the follow up next week? I haven't got a clue what's going to happen, but City need to keep Barcelona out next week, and that's the only way they that they might have a chance of even getting it to a, a an extra time scenario although that's not really what we want. So, all in all, I think they're going to be very, very disappointed. Um, I've still got to keep the belief that we can pull it back next week. It's going to be difficult, but you never know. Football's a crazy game, as they say. Um, so, let's just hope they can pull it back next week. All right, I'll catch you again soon. Bye for now.